If you'll remember, we told you recently about a young memory expert from the United States who was preparing for his biggest test yet, an appearance on a popular Chinese reality quiz show called The Brain. Now the 20-year-old is back home, and that's where CCTV's Hendrik Sobrandi picks up the story from the U.S. state of Colorado. Jack of diamonds, ten of diamonds. When we last left Johnny Briones, he was rattling off the contents of a deck of playing cards whose exact sequence he committed to memory. Johnny Briones. A lot has happened in Johnny's life since then. A couple of weeks ago, this 20-year-old U.S. memory master appeared on the Chinese TV quiz show, The Brain. John and Morales, I hold the U.S. speed card record for memorizing bigger cards the fastest, and I'm here to win for America. He and two other Americans went up against three Chinese memory experts. We're here to pump you up. Johnny is quite good at remembering cards, numbers, and words, but producers of the brain gave him an utterly impossible challenge, memorizing cows. His first thought? First thought, it doesn't seem impossible. You know, like, this is like totally completely different from cards, numbers, words. He was given photographs of a hundred different cows to study before he left for China. As he always does, he attached images to each one to help them each stand out in his mind. Some of it was just like half black, half white. I was like, I have no idea what I see. An ice cream sandwich? Like, I don't know. So I just had to like make something up that kind of made sense. <laughs> Once in China, Johnny was brought to a cow farm for an up-close inspection. Do cows have twins or triplets? Then when the show began, they asked him to identify three of the hundred cows and their tag numbers. One of the animals proved to be his undoing. Something happened. The cow in the middle turned around in its cage, so the wrong side was facing me. I'm like, I never see this side of a cow ever. I've never seen this pattern in my life. So I was totally thrown off by it. Johnny Ace round two, correctly picking six out of 600 puzzle pieces that corresponded to one of those hundred cows whose tag number he'd been given. But that wrong way heifer cost him in the end. The Americans lost, but his week in China was a big win. It was a great experience, though. Great time. It really pushed my memory to its limit. Oh, 12? That's my middle school. More memory competitions lie in Johnny's future, but he now knows cows backwards and forwards. They're a puzzle no more. Three weeks, my life consists of nothing but cows, and I hate cows now. <laughs> Hendrick Sabrandi, CCTV, Wheat Ridge, Colorado.